Good morning. Good morning. It's a pleasure. It's a privilege. What a great honor to teach the body of Christ on Saturdays. This Saturday, we're continuing our teaching on why go to church? Why should we go to church? Amen. And remember, we have seen that going to church is not just for the sake of the building. We do not just go to church because we belong to a particular group of people and we have to drive to that building. Or you belong to a particular group of people and you need to click to join a YouTube channel for live recordings or a Facebook channel or whatever means, maybe uh, Instagram. All of those are considered a church because it's a called a group of called out ones, right? But now you have to know the reason why you do it, why you click or why you drive to go meet a body of believers. One of the things we said during our recordings, which I will ask that if this is your first, that you will stop and go look up previous teachings or recordings that we've done on this topic. There's actually a playlist on this channel in regards to why I go to church. This is should be the 10th, this is number 10 in this series. And one of the series we said that to avoid an end time mistake, an end time trap, we need to go to church and be among a group of believers. We have seen so much, like I said, and we have been looking at the book of Hebrews chapter 12 from verse 22 and today we're making progress we've seen 22 23 and today we're, we're looking at verse 24 hebrews chapter 12 verse 24 says that going to church is going to jesus the mediator of the new covenant now a lot of people know jesus as the mediator of the new covenant but then as pertaining to this series I will want us to see something that maybe you have not or you had not seen it you'll be seeing it today and that important fact is the fact that yes important fact is the fact that jesus went to church amen so if you're doubting you're like wait a minute you said going to church is going to jesus yes when he was here on earth do you know he went to church Yes, Jesus did. He went to church. And when he went to church, he participated in the service. Amen. Now, it's very important that we read from the word of God so that what we are learning will not just be theory. It will be something you can actually apply to your life and, and, and see results. That's what we've done throughout the series. So let's pro progress go to the book of luke chapter 8 verse 18 with me please luke chapter 4 verse 18 you see that um i think we will have to back up to verse verse 7 no verse 16 that's right verse 16 it says that jesus came to nazareth where he was brought up and as his custom was did you see that word as his custom was he went to the synagogue now the synagogue is his fellowship location that's where he went to fellowship with other christians or with other children of god now not christians at that time so he said as his custom was he went to the synagogue on the sabbath day he went there and he stood up and read what is that telling you and i going to church is not just going to a building you need to what participate so why do we go to church we go to church because jesus goes to church can you repeat that with me say i go to church because i know that my lord and my savior went to church and still goes to church 
you look in the book of revelation it's clear he said jesus was there at the door of the church and he was knocking he said he wants to come in why because that is his custom when he was here on earth he went to church and i am of the opinion that jesus comes to your church i'm also of the opinion that jesus come to our youtube channels i'm also of the opinion that when you when you do facebook live he's right there with you amen so whatever we do like the bible says in colossians do it as unto the lord go to church for him go to church to meet him miss Emma, at my church people don't talk to each other now there's a question mark uh, um if you go to a church where people don't like to fellowship with other people my question first is are you sure that's your congregation oh i go to this youtube uh, um live that people don't say hello to each other i usually like this woman teaching on facebook but she never say hello to anybody now i think you have to ask yourself is this jesus if jesus was the uh, one doing this youtube channel will he say hello i think he will one of the things about jesus character that maybe you have not heard or you've not been taught is that he was a very friendly person he was very lively children don't go to grumpy people that's one of the reasons i say stay in joyville because when you stay in joyville you don't only attract good things you attract children and all of us know that children will not come to somebody that is grumpy what are we saying this morning we're saying go to church because you're going for jesus sake and you're going to meet him the book of hebrews where we've been studying chapter 12 verse 24 says it clearly he said when we go to church we're coming to the assembly of the firstborn and we're coming to jesus the mediator of the new covenant and then we've seen here in the book of luke chapter 4 verse 18 that jesus went to church as a custom means he went often there's nothing like he got tired going to church miss Eva, do you want me to go to church and be persecuted like jesus did he never stopped jesus was persecuted at church people ridiculed him at church as a matter of fact he got tired of them doing stupidity he whooped them up but even after then he didn't stop he wasn't afraid of them child of god no matter what is going on except you have a clear indication from the lord or you know that it is a real outstanding case of abuse then you can leave a church but if not but this is the caution even if you leave a church building even if you drop from a youtube channel even if you leave a a, a, a a facebook life community do not leave jesus amen when jesus quit uh, or left the temple for some occasions he will get out and walk in their midst and leave because they wanted to kill him but he never stopped going to church he never stopped going to the synagogue he never stopped believing and loving daddy amen no matter what is happening stay faithful to going to church because jesus went to church the next thing i want you to do is stay in joy view. amen stay grateful life is a privilege don't let anybody push you to grumpy land don't let anybody make you sad guess what honestly they don't have that power don't take the bed to be sad enjoy your weekend amen enjoy your weekend glory to god amen and amen 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 oh you thought i was going to forget yes i'm back select your things for tomorrow's service and pray for tomorrow's service oh yeah i almost forgot the holy ghost to remind them about service so yes make sure that you select your clothes put your shoes together so that tomorrow morning you will not be rushing amen pray for the service oh yes pray for your pastor pray for your leaders it's such a great thing to do repeat after me father i go safe to church tomorrow I thank you for a great ride. Lord, I thank you for my pastor, that he will hear you and he will speak your mind to us. In Jesus' name, amen. Yes, you can go and pray some more, but this right here shows that you're ready. In Jesus' name.
Amen. Amen. Amen.